Let's -a go. About to make a comment about like more money I can't do anything with, but actually, it's technically not full right now. So that's different. <laughs> Snake eater joke. Wow, I did it. That's a little mean to have a fucking fire bat that just shows up. And I think this game genuinely has some unavo unavoidable damage, or at least damage that if it can be avoided at all, you'd have to avoid via like basically having played the game already and knowing in advance where the weird gotchas are gonna come from. Oopsie. didn't actually equip it. There we go. Fuck you! Okay. Whoa! Spinny jellyfish. We haven't seen you for a while, have we? Can I climb around? These whirlpools... Maybe they don't matter? I was worried they might matter. <laughs> I grew with concern about app ah, shit. Oh, they hurt you. What? How is it hurting me? What? <laughs> the water spins a little bit. I'm gonna die. Ah, why didn't you jump? Ah. It's such a crap shoot whether your character's gonna jump or not in some of these situations. He just does what he feels like. You done? Okay. Thought he was coming for me. There it is. We're suddenly dealing with some familiar Krizoa foes. Hmm. Ah. Immediately. Had a little bit more inertia on that run than I thought. Whoops. Boop, boop, boop. Do, 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 do. Why is there a glowy red light coming? Ah. You could see it through the box before I did that. It was interesting. Ha! God damn it. Uh This kind of thing's always precarious and like a in like modern games, like Dark Souls, and that's when you have full camera control. But in these games you don't have full camera control, so the struggle is real. Come on. Whew, okay. Uh... A little concerned about how it doesn't seem like I can go any further. Um... Oh, there it is. What? No, I picked... That's weird. I think I'm able to fire a blue blast while fire is selected, but I think I can't fire a... But I can't fire fire while blue is selected. To be clear, so the, what's going on is if you press Y, you can map it as your shortcut for when you hit Y. Oh God. 
But you can also press A. But the issue is that sometimes it just ignores whatever you have currently selected when you're pressing A, and it just fires whatever is mapped to, to Y instead. And it's like, well then, why let me even press A? Apparently, it has to be mapped as my shortcut no matter what. So what's the choice here? Are we gonna play cup game again? Hopefully you've got a better challenge than the last one did. The test of combat, oh. Prove your worth in combat by defeating all the sharp claw within the time limit. If you succeed, I will become yours. To return to Krizoa Palace. Are they gonna be real sharp? They're real sharp claws! They're not like imagine they're not like ghost sharp claws summoned by the magic villain of whatever. It's just a regular real sharp claw. It's just here. These guys just got like summoned in here to get murdered by me. I don't care about how much anything. <laughs> I do it? Nope. Dude, ice makes it so fast because they can't block it. I'm going too fast for them to spawn. Why didn't he even react? Okay. Wow, I had minutes left. You did it! You cl collected the second Krizoa spirit! It will remain in your body until you take it to the Krizoa Palace, where it must be released. That one pterodactyl had one line of dialogue in the whole game, and it's burned into my brain. Considering how much margin I had left in that one, I think we're just finding that like the Krizoa spirits have a very low standard for verifying whether or not someone's worthy of taking them. You have proven yourself to be pure of heart. What? Bring the spirit to Krizoa Palace. I will guide you further when you get there. Come to Krizoa Palace. In what way does that test verify anything about my purity of heart? <laughs> ah, you you were very violent. <laughs> Somebody who wasn't pure of heart wouldn't be very violent, so... You must be pretty alright, I guess. I'm like, excuse me? Should I remind you of the part where I was very violent? You. Come here. A bad guy. I can't hit him, he's above me. God damn it. I don't remember what was here. Ah, the cheating well. Ah, oh, you can't slide down this because it's not a letter. The glowing eyes are really creepy. Yeah. I look like the bad guy now. A bad- he's talking about me. I'm the- a bad guy! I carefully avoid the vines, I can go faster. <laughs> I won't have to climb down them. Where are we going? A bad guy. Uh oh. Ha 
Is there a teleport out of dungeon ability like in Zelda games? Just thinking about like how am I gonna leave? Oh, there was a cliff over here. Oh yeah, there's like a whole zone I haven't done here. Maybe this bomb will suddenly make sense? A bad guy! Oh, oh god. Goes to the air with you. That's alarming. Oh, there, look at it go. We'll never see that again. Ah, it's gotta go there. So when I go into one of these things, I immediately drop it, and it goes in the direction I was going at the time, I guess. So I have to, like, figure out some kind of plan here. Wow, it was in a hurry. <laughs> ah, ah, why did he throw it instead of putting it? Oh, right, he doesn't put stuff down. That's so weird. It's so weird you can't put something down. When you plant your feet. Okay, hey, it's this one weird... Yeah, this was a while ago. That was the place I wanted to jump down to before. Yeah, I remember that. It was the exit all along. <laughs> those things are... Those guys are so weird. And they're so enthusiastic. Oop. Ow. Worth it. They started the barrels again? Didn't that kill everybody? So we gotta get back to the statue, right? Yeah. I was thinking about the R wing, but I just remembered that the, uh, the statue guy, the warp stone. Uh, he gives you the ability to fly to that one ice place. And Krizoa Palace. And that's it. Oh god. He's dead. Wow, they sent me back. Is that my first death? If it counted as one, is really threatening. It's really unnerving. It's like, oh god, Fox, no, I'm sorry. Oh god. That portrait's interesting. It looks like almost a different version of Fox than the one in this game. Like his, his health meter or something? It's like, I don't know if it's if it's like it's like I'm surviving poison for this long meter or if it's like how long I can, how he can hold his breath. I don't think it was never. I don't think it was ever necessarily contextualized. Cause I think it's only shown up there so far. Why? Why did you give me the error message? Do it. Oh God. His weird agape, agape mouth, wide-eyed expression when he feeds Tricky is just sort of sinister looking when it's, his eyes are glowing purple. A dead expression. It's the, uh, it's the same sort of like slack jaw look he has actually when you pick your save in this game. They just kind of made a choice like we're gonna have Fox's mouth just be wide open. Uh, no, let's not go to the store. The store is useless to me until I can get a bigger bag. It might be worth checking periodically just to see if his stock ever changes, but if his stock doesn't change, then I have no use for him until I have the 130 bag. Or whatever bag is big enough for that. Krazoa Palace. To go to Krazoa Palace. Uh, 
I wonder if his stock of teleport spots will, it, will ever change, or if it'll always just be like Krizoa Palace and one other place. I thought he was going to be the person that teleports me to every level as I unlock them, but I just walked to them. And me walking to them doesn't even add them to like the list of places I can teleport to. It makes him like a very so weird this is Palace. system. Okay, Tricky. Let's find out where we can release the spirit. Tricky? Tricky! Ah, ah, sorry. I forgot to tell you. I cannot warp dinosaurs. That's a shame. I can still hear you, Fox. <sighs> why can you hear him? Wait, why can you hear him? That wasn't established. Do you have a psychic link to Fox? Huh, this is like a big palace. Look at this, like, palace of stone and whatnot. And maybe not stone? I don't know. I'm still a little surprised to see this... This... This is like the... That one kind of, like, iron or whatever that we have on Earth. That has that exact, like, sunflower seeds pe texture or whatever. I don't know what the fuck to call it. <laughs> Term corrugated iron comes to mind, but I have no idea if that's what it's called. And I don't care that much! Oh, gotta kill them. I don't think they care about that. Why won't it? Ah. Oh, that, wow, that destroys him. Delete. Delete. Hmm. Three different quality levels in one room. Hmm. Hi, everybody. Is there something to blow up around here? I guess I'll have to settle for you! To it. Yeah, I was worried about the beeping, thinking, thinking it was in time limit, but I guess I might just beep. Well, that's going to cause some problems for my ability to navigate this place. Okay. How long does this last? What? Oh, there's ramps. Can I, like, light more torches or something? It's another Pikachu. I have, do I have too many Pikachus? I got too many Pikachus. I've never lost a single one yet. That one's just gonna get wasted now. All right. Well, this is a simple enough environment that I don't think I need to waste another lantern. They didn't give me any fireflies here, so if I run out, I'm in trouble. kind of interesting how you can see yourself so perfectly. But well, you can actually more or less see the environment here. Just very slightly. No! And then it exploded. Okay. Yeah. I keep forgetting how finicky this is. Specifically, some of the variations of things you can do that just make you drop it. Okay, so we need to take the middle path. 
Um. But there was an obstacle here too. Oh, is it? Oh, is it beeping faster? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> hey, nailed it. See, I think there's a. Yeah, there's a barrier there and there, so you can't actually walk it in. You have to throw it. But I got it. Hey, a new one. Alright, we're done with that entire part of the level. It doesn't matter anymore. And the next crack is right in front of me. Okay, guys, you can, you can give me some health. Can you not? Bro? Oh, hey. Oh, God! They move now. I don't know if I call that an upgrade. Okay, so that time it let me fire without remapping it. It's hard to say what causes the confusion. I don't know. Delete. Looks like a mounted machine gun. Is that gonna go on my? Oh, <gasps> it's nope, nope. It's not an upgrade. Wow, wow. Guys, if you if you put it in the glowy sphere as a spinning object, every video game ever tells you, oh, that's a power up or an upgrade. I get that by touching it. It's like no, that's an enemy. <laughs> what? The fuck? I have to wait for it to rotate past so it doesn't shoot me. Oh god, it turns back. What? Stop it. Okay, whatever. Good enough. <laughs> Explode. Monkey destruction switch. Hmm. Hello, friend. I hit him, is he gonna find me? Okay. Um, what can I set up? Oh, right. Before the fire trap, there was a barrel. There's an ambiguity to where the fire actually is, so this is always a little tense. Oh, God. Wow, I have not got hit by it. This is one of those situations where you can put it down without throwing it, right? Yeah. They happen when they feel like it. Hi. <laughs> Beat spamming two entire combos, I guess. It's kind of amusing because the AI just doesn't know what to do about it. Like, oh, he's just spraying me with an ice beam. I... Oh well. <laughs> I didn't want to win anyway. Hmm. I can't do this one, okay. <clears throat> so this is... I thought Crystal went like that way or something. I don't know. Yeah, this, we, were, we were here as Crystal. 
I doubled back to check the other thing to make sure I couldn't use it. And I couldn't. Oh, Crystal got kidnapped, like, right around here, right? You've been here before. Thank you for coming. Go die in a hole, please. Whoop! Okay. We're going places. <laughs> We're sneezing places. I'm fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Ugh. Oh god. I'm sneezing now. Stop it. Oh, I got it. I was worried like I couldn't aim that high. It's still pretty glow. Oh, yeah. Oh, I ran out. My greatest fear realized. I have to do regular fighting again. Ow. Yeah, am I gonna impersonate a dinosaur? That's the second time I've seen one of those. This one's even by a dinosaur door. I don't know if burning, if putting those out was even gonna do, do anything. Do I have to go down here? It seems like I have to go somewhere else and like power this on. There's not like a button anywhere. Hmm, I can go higher. But also maybe any maybe I should re-explore lower? I didn't necessarily check out the previous floor. <laughs> he doesn't like it. He's very afraid. This place is very big. This might take a while. Hmm, maybe this is the different places you can turn yours in? Because that's another indi indication of that one blue door hole that is, that is back by... Tricky's mom. I think I want to fall down. Yep, sorry, buddy. Wow, well, he did not like that. I didn't necessarily actually explore this floor. And for all I know, my goal is down here. It might be that each floor up there is where you put the next spirit. That's weird. I can go further down. Uh. Yeah. So it seems it won't let me in. 
But I think that's where Crystal put the first spirit. This whole area seems to only exist as being where you land if you fall somewhere. Did somebody order another snake eater joke? Wow, thanks fam. Okay, so the first floor was a blue door. That one's got a transform door. I tried this one before too, I believe. Maybe not? I don't know. Let's deal with this guy because he's attacking me! And it's very rude. What is it? Is it pulling downward instead of pushing upward? What's going on? Why did that one no work? This one works. Bye! Where am I? Oh, hey, it's Crystal. There she is. It's so can't believe they named you Crystal and then they trapped you in a crystal. Wow, she's beautiful. Really? Whoa, a Crisoa spirit. But how do I get mine in there? I was 1000% not prepared for the fox is horny fucking saxophone theme. What? Stop getting swallowed. <laughs> that would definitely terrify me, dribbling through space right like that. There, Fox. Time for you to head down to the seaside. Check the signposts for directions. Okay, big fella. Good to see you doing your job and helping out. You cheeky little boy. <laughs> Now, I've been keeping this back for you, ready for when you needed it. You just had it the whole time? You dick. Hi, Fox. We're all back. Download. 
Cape Claw. You know, now we gotta go to that place where I, need, where I spend 100, where I spend 60, oh. Oh, they're out of the way now. Like, there's that place I can only access when I have 60 ru uh, rupees. Scarabs, so that's probably next. There's a few questions that I think Fox isn't asking. And a combination of stuff that we know and that he and and that we don't know, both he, he and us uh, separately. Because like, we know Crystal got captured by something that attacked her. Because it, 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 it they had the predator vision that was the enemy's perspective or whatever. But Fox doesn't know about that stuff. But something captured her. But even from even from Fox's perspective, like. He's like, no, ah, somebody help me, don't hurt me, ah. And like, she's just sitting in a crystal. Who is hurting her? How are they hurting her? Isn't she just in a crystal? Is she just dreaming about bad things that aren't actually happening? But also like, even then when we get there and there's that discontinuity of like, how those two, those two things don't seem like they match up. The Krizoa spirits are also not giving us any more explanation. They're just like, Oh, uh, she will be saved if you get all the Krizoa spirits. And like... It looks a lot like the Krizoa spirits are holding her captive, if you look at that place. It's like... I feel like Fox should have a few questions. It, it almost makes the... It kind of makes the Krizoa spirits seem insidious. Also, it seems to set up the idea that Crystal... Was Crystal only getting the Krizoa spirits? So like, she didn't... Know anything about... She wasn't trying to... Like, this world's falling apart. Was she not fixing that? Was she only going after the Krizoa spirits? That's a completely different, like, situation. Huh. 